Uh, hello YouTube, this is David T Media bringing you another video. Um, it's uh, quite a disappointing time for us Xbox fans at the moment with the Redfall release. It's got a lot of issues, but I've stated my issues with the online component and having to create an account to, uh, to uh, play the game. I wasn't able to play the game because of this, but some people are saying Phil Spencer needs to go. That's a load of nonsense. He's turned Xbox around. He's made Xbox Game Pass the future of gaming. He's made the world's most powerful console. He's made the world's most affordable console, the Xbox Series S. He's done so much for gaming, the, the exclusives and the Xbox Studio games up to this point have been higher rated than PlayStation exclusives. Hi-Fi Rush, if you add the Metacritic score and the user score, is higher rated than uh, God of War Ragnarok. And then you've got Flight Simulator, which is really well rated. And uh, you've got Forza Horizon 5, which is really high, high, highly rated. Minecraft Legends, which is really, really good, but not highly rated. I personally like, like uh, um, Minecraft Legends. Then you've got Pentiment, new IPs like Pentiment and Grounded. And you've got all sorts. Gears of War 5 is good in my opinion. Gears of War Tactics is really good. They're making a lot of good exclusives this generation. And we've got Forza Motorsport this year. Possibly Hellblade 2. And Starfield. Hopefully Starfield doesn't have the same problems that uh, Red Bull has, because if it is, it will be a huge disappointment for me. Hopefully Bethesda can learn from their mistakes and not make only online games. Um, anyway, that's my little rant oh, about, about, about Phil Spencer. Oh, no, um, let me know what you think about Phil Spencer in the comments. I think he's doing a great job with the Xbox brand. Um, and yeah, I think uh, he should stay. This is David T Media logging out.